and a doctor is saying, well, there's no science behind it. And you're saying, I'm not going crazy. I put needles in that person and their headaches have gone. Or I took gluten out of their diet and they feel better. I don't, why should I be waiting for science to prove something that I'm seeing all the time? So if you tuned in recently, you have heard me talking about how I did a seven-day fast. And you may remember me mentioning somebody who I consulted with to sort of help set that up. And his name is Dr. Frank Lippmann. He is a friend of mine and also a physician who is trained in both Eastern and Western medicine with a really unique lens on what it means and takes to be healthy. We have recorded a prior podcast that goes deep into his fascinating story growing up in South Africa, being trained in medicine, working in Soweto, coming to the Bronx, the South Bronx in New York City at a time where that was not a very safe or, or fun place to be. I asked him to come back because he has a new book out now called How to Be Well, where he takes a bit of a contrarian view on what it actually takes. Now, there's some stuff that we sort of all know, but there's some kind of different provocative ideas. I also was fascinated by his concept of putting together the six different pillars of health or well-being in sort of the structure of a mandala, which is this ancient format for organizing sacred wisdom. And I wanted to talk with him about that as well. Hope you enjoy this conversation. I'm Jonathan Fields, and this is Good Life Project. Good Life Project is supported by ShipStation. Here's my question. Do you sell online on eBay? 